new journal and yet gonna sign the Abaton. How do you feel like is it going so far? I love Abaton. Mm -hmm. I complete. I don't do the the genre, but I love it. Who is your favorite? Hari Chris, Hari Chris, ni mnoma sana. Tipsy, mana tipsy. Furthermore, Trio is also doing amazing. So yeah, yeah. Now I'm playing. You see that? I'm playing again. Abanton by, by sana. Much love to those guys. Welcome, my guys. This is Skaters Prom. I'm here with. Ochiko. Ochiko, can you tell us more about yourself? I am a singer, top tier songwriter, mm. performer. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Uh, what challenges have you faced so far when it comes to music? Um, okay, so working as a songwriter mostly now for artists, publishing systems in Kenya are not very functional. Matuna um, policies then is in a work to feed uh, the artist after the song is out. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, split sheets, they too don't really translate to the work that's been done. Mm -hmm. Yes, beyond your Kenya to struggle now at the moment. Who a solution in Ghana? Building policies that work. At wow. least I'm, I'm appreciating that um, kuna a lot of distribution companies and publishing companies which are coming on board, Kenyan companies more so. Zenye zina kam, zina work na policies, zenye ni functional for a songwriter or people who are working as composers in the industry for artists. Mm -hmm. yeah. Do you feel like songwriters and producers are most underrated people in the music industry? I think so, but it's a burden that we we are okay carrying, you know. Like um, when I'm an artist, it's okay. I can be the superstar. I can be where the light is on. But when I'm a writer, not everyone really gets to see and know who I am until when they acquire credits mm -hmm. or it's acknowledged uh -huh. somewhere. Be yeah. Because most of the artists they don't credit. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And uh, who are the artists uh, have you worked with so far? Um, so far, I've worked with Tanashadona, Masauti, I've worked with Hamza from UK, I've worked with Tenny from Nigeria, mm. I've worked with Fancy Fingers, mm. Though, just to name a few. Uh -huh. Kinoti, Modest uh -huh. Chabari, yes. Uh -huh. yeah. What's your relationship between you and Kinoti when it comes to music? Um, we have one of the biggest love songs in the city, yeah. So we've been uh -huh. close boys, we write together a lot, yeah. Which uh -huh. is uh, one of his favorite songs to you? There's a song called Follow. People, I don't know if people know it enough, but I think Follow is an amazing song. Then obviously Nitangoja. Mm -hmm. Kinoti is a dope ass artist, uh -huh. so yeah, Nimnoma. Yeah. Your favorite song so far? My, from him. From you, your song? Oh, my, my own songs. Uh -huh. uh, obviously, Like You. Mm -hmm. Like You is top of the list, followed by Slowly and Yeo featuring Costa Ojong. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, can you tell us more about Slowly? Slowly. We have inspired Nini. Slowly is just a bad love song, man. Uh, met, met someone who was ready for everything and I wasn't. Me not only the toxic person. Mm. So she was ready for like KBS commitments. Mm. Yes, that's, that's the surface level story. Do you mean it's based on a true story? It is, it is, it is. Uh -huh. Slowly is based on a true story. Uh -huh. yeah. Do you apologize to your ex? Do I? I don't think so. I don't think so. X is X. X is X. More money pass. Yes. Once okay. you step, you don't go back. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, when it comes to performance, yeah. uh, you know, uh, there's live performance on stage. And Pia, kuna wale wasani when you perform just, wana kango mao wa perform, na wasi, lazimu kuna band team, nini. What do you think is the difference na wasi, being so creative? Um, so for, for performances, I feel like they are custom made. And whatever you choose to go with, make sure you're top of the tier, make sure you're at the top of the list. Mm. Because depending on um, what stage it is, mm. stages then you can't do a live band. If you do if you're doing something like Tomorrowland, that's a house gig, need DJs, you're not coming there with a band. You see. But there are shows, if you're doing O2, if you're playing O2, you have to come with a band because no one's about to feel O2 and then you can't play with a DJ, you see. So it's dependent on what space you're playing, where you're playing, mm. yes. Do you feel like uh, most of the Kenyan artists are no good performers when it comes to live band? Most. You know, live band is a whole, is a whole, is a whole career. The, the same way you're in studio, yeah. yes, the same way you're in studio building a whole persona of who you are as an artist is the same way when you're on stage, there needs to be a whole personality. Uh -huh. So many people know Giuliani, 
but there's a whole generation who know Giuliani from being on stage mm. Naku, Sheikh mm. Madrid, you get? Mm. Yes. Mm. Do you feel like Kenyan music is playing? It is, right now it is. Uh -huh. Right now it is. Uh -huh. Right now it is. Right what now it about is. Uh, the new the new genre song, the new genre and yet gonna sign your button. How do you feel like is it going so far? I love a mm -hmm. I complete I don't do the, the genre but I love it. Who is your favorite? Harry Craze, Harry Noma Sana, Tipsy, Mana Tipsy, uh -huh. Furthermore, uh -huh. Trio is also doing Trio. amazing. Uh -huh. So, yeah, uh -huh. yeah, 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 I feel like it's a process that is already working. Like, you know, it's not one of those things that Tamkaleo and every DJ, every club, every restaurant is playing KE. Ni process pole pole, but it's process ni process and yemekua ilianza 2018-19 play KE. And it's five years later and we're doing so much better. So much better. To go in our own gig right now na Abanton in a play. So we are doing so well. The thing is, Sasa, what was Ilale? Every industry, um, from film to uh, service industry to the music industry, everyone has to be an ambassador of KE so that it actually works. Yeah. Yes. Uh, you ever heard what happened the feel between him and Dr. Fueneke? Artists should be paid when it comes to they want to get interviews. I feel like it's dependent. Who has the leverage? Kuna interviews then you kienda, you as the artist carry the leverage. So me coming to your yes, yes, me coming to your show is bringing a lot of viewership your way. So it makes more benefit. Like it's more beneficial to you than it is to me. And there's a time when I as the artist need the interview more, need to put my need to get my work out, need people to be talking about me. So I need to be seen more. So it's more beneficial to me uh, being in the interviews compared to the other way. So you don't always have to be paid. Yeah, cool. it's, it's not a, a, no, yeah. a thought that works. Yeah. Right. Last question is, what is the biggest secret you ever had in music people didn't know till now? Keep working. Keep working. For speed Kenyans, Kenyans love receiving. When you give, the, when, when you give them music consistently, in fact, when you give them any art consistently, they eventually take it. Yes. Okay. You guys, thank you for tuning in. Kenyan Ziki, and we are the news.